My friends, 26 years ago here in Belarus, people tasted their first French fries and Vikmak. So Belarus became the 100th anniversary country for McDonald's. And you cannot believe it was the first country in the world where they opened three restaurants at once. Midnight, we're opening McDonald's! And it was really huge celebration. Belarusian people were very happy. And McDonald's itself, they organized a firework, a huge cake they were tasting. Orchestra was playing and they were cutting uh, red ribbons. So it was really, really amazing. People were queuing at all three restaurants to come in. Because it was, of course, such a sad time after USSR. People were very inspired when a foreign brand came here to Belarus. And I also remember how I was asking my parents, please, let's go to Minsk and let's go to McDonald's. Basically, not because of food, just because of all this, you know, marketing, which they did, of course, as well for kids. So my parents were really strict. They were saying it's not a good idea because it's bad for your health. And that's why in my entire life I have never been to McDonald's before. And I feel now a little bit strange and sad maybe even, because uh, now if I want to taste McDonald's, I need to fly somewhere, because on 21st of November McDonald's was closed in Belarus under this brand due to the sanctions. And on 28th of November they reopened all the restaurants with another brand. And we all here expected that all the restaurants, uh, former McDonald's, will be reopened under Russian brand Vkusna i Toshka. But this is not the case. Uh, the brand named KSB uh, Victory Restaurant. <laughs> And uh, I just was talking with the manager, she was saying that basically all the products, uh, all the ingredients, uh, all the menu is uh, the same, so no change at all. Just the only one thing which they changed is of course some names where they used to have like mug. So let's come inside and check the food. It's gonna be my first time. <laughs> Что-нибудь самое популярное, что у вас берут обычно? А Какой-то Биг Мак или что, как это называется? Картошка Big фри, наверное? сейчас нету. Биг Мака нету? Mm -hmm. А будет? Ну, не знаю. <laughs> Колу и фанту, и спрайт, все осталось. Uh -huh. Все же булочки, которые были раньше, все осталось тоже же uh -huh. Давайте тогда вот эти пара чизбер. Без, без... С картошечкой или с напитком? С картошечкой. Хорошо, картошка будет фри, маленькая порция. Да. Как вы зовут? Меня Кирилл зовут. Кирилл. So his name is Kirill. Very nice. Thank you. Окей. Okay. Uh, nice to meet you. Заберу сам. Uh, заберу сам. Все, хорошо. Блогер? Да. Откуда к нам? Очень я... хорошо английский у нас. Ну да, да. Так, значит, я с вот этим к вам жду, да? Вы мне скажете, да. когда. Вы подходите, да, говорите номер вашего заказа и вас рассчитываю. Супер, спасибо большое. Здравствуйте. So, my friends, uh, here we go. This is a French fries. Look at the sign which they got now. And here is a cheeseburger. I all this taste my first time. Of course, French fries I was eating at the restaurants, but uh, this is gonna be my first cheeseburger in life. Oh. I asked without salt, but it's really salty. I don't know what is gonna be with salt. Okay, now let's open cheeseburger. The guy asked me which kind of stuff I want inside. I didn't know. So I was saying, okay, let's keep everything. Uh, let's uh, basically open. Oh, this is uh, cheese, uh, uh, ketchup, 
one small uh, um, cucumber. Uh, uh, ah, where is meat? But ah, my meat is here. <laughs> meat is here. Oh, it's onion inside. <sighs> no kissing today, guys. <laughs> okay, let's taste it. I think it tastes quite good. Guys, it's really my first cheeseburger ever, so... I don't know. Tastes really good. And guys, look, they basically hide it, this M, as you can see, on the sauce. Almost nothing has changed. It's still quite popular. People are here. It's Saturday morning and uh, the taste was good. I almost finished uh, my order. It cost just four rubles, which is also super cheap. I didn't know that it's so cheap here. The menu also quite the same. The guy was saying that only just one position was missed. Coca-Cola is also still here. And in general, in Belarus, we have Coca-Cola, even though we created our own Bella Cola. Just let you know that in Belarus, we still also have KFC, Burger King, uh, KFC by the way existing only Miga, the biggest one probably in Belarus. Uh, people I also know that like it. And I was also surprised uh, because uh, the staff who work here at the restaurant, they were very, very nice to me. They were talking openly, share all the information. So it was a really nice experience. And uh, yeah, I was happy that I came exactly to this restaurant. It is uh, on uh, Pritiskava. I will give you the address. So you can also come here if you want. And I was really happy to read your comments under the picture which I posted yesterday from the entrance of this restaurant where I was explaining that they reopened already and uh, I was planning to come and film for you. And you were saying that uh, basically you are happy that uh, uh, we have something our own right now here in Belarus because uh, of course uh, we know all about the quality of uh, the food uh, at McDonald's. But I I should say guys that McDonald's uh, they were super popular because of their branding because of the marketing which they created through these all years and for Belarusian young people students it was really cool and uh, nice to meet uh, at the restaurants and uh, I'm not sure that uh, our brands are able to create such a good positive you know uh, branding for their company let's see I hope it will happen but of course so uh, yes yeah, it's, it's really important and this is part of uh, you know the success what about me of course if uh, I would think McDonald's or there is a Belarusian quite famous also brand chain of uh, restaurants uh, Vasilki it's also quite uh, cheap food but very good quality it's uh, all our natural products Belarusian so I would of course choose Vasilki but again as you can see the branding is working not so well like McDonald's so even the good the food is good the prices are good it's not so popular as uh, used to be McDonald's but I hope it will change through the years and uh, my friends thank you so much as always for watching this video as you know I work right now uh, in general for nine years <laughs> almost I work at the travel agency and uh, currently the uh, you know our work is quite uh, less demanded so uh, YouTube channel becoming for me more and more the main uh, income so it would be great if you support my work uh, with uh, becoming a sponsor or super thanks believe me it helped me a lot to grow the channel and to be inspired <laughs> and have motivation to do create more and more videos here on the channel thank you so much and see you soon